What's up, YouTube? Back with another video. Uh, if you hear me lifting, <laughs> it's because I have my retainers in. But that's aside the point. This video is going to be about my future plans for the car. <clears throat> I just got off of work. I'm literally in the parking lot recording this. I need to get gas. I'm going to go to the gas station and then we'll start the video. Just pulled up that Chevron. It's kind of loud. I don't know if you can hear me. But gas right now. $5.68. It's kind of ridiculous. Car looks nice. A little bit of poop on my hood. It's been kind of sad. The car looks a little bit. Yeah. She just adopted her car else with Stitch. <laughs> So the first little car, this medic mod that I'm gonna do, it's not much of a mod, but I'm basically just gonna paint these Brembo's. I already have the paint. I got a G2 kit. So these fat ass calipers are gonna be painted yellow and then black lettering for the Brembo. And then I have been seeing a lot of uh, people doing these like Cobra Jet decals on the side. I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna do a yellow as well. So, and then, I think I'm gonna change it to yellow too. I think that looks sick. So those are the first little cosmetic mods. And then I may be lowering it soon, but we'll see. I'm gonna finish the rest once I park at the at the parking lot I'm planning to go to. Uh, 68 bucks to fill up the gallon, but I did have 50 miles left, so not too bad this time. Alright, so I found my spot where I wanna record. So where I left off, where I was talking about the brakes, I was talking about the, the yellow decal on the side, so it's gonna be like a black and yellow theme. After that, I'm probably gonna do a cold air intake. This, so this is gonna be like the power mod section. I'm gonna do a cold air intake, <coughs> long tube headers. Um, I haven't decided if I wanna go boosting the car. I think what's gonna make me decide is that if the car so if the car ends up blowing up with the oil consumption or whatever, and I get a Gen 2 engine put into it, I'll probably end up boosting the car. But if that doesn't happen for like a year, um, and the car is healthier or whatnot, I'm gonna probably, I'm probably gonna cam the engine. So, flex fuel, E85, all that good stuff. So I'm also gonna do a resonator delete so it can sound like the R. I think it's gonna sound badass. Um, I mean, right now it looks like a fishbowl. You can see straight through the mirror, so I gotta do window tint. <clears throat> so I think I already mentioned the lowering springs. So the ride height on these cars from the factory, honestly, isn't that bad. It's about two fingers. Um, so the performance, the Ford performance lowering springs only lowers it about 0.75 inches. I think it's 0.78 as a matter of fact on all four corners. So I'm probably just gonna do that because it's already pretty low. I don't want to have it slammed. And as you can see, my lip is how it was when I bought the car. It's already kind of bent up a little bit. And then I, to be honest, I might as well get a new lip. And then lastly, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do this or if I really want to do it, but I might do underglow. I might do some yellow. I know it's kind of like, <laughs> kind of silly, but I think it. I think this car could pull it off. You know, if you have like a little Honda or something, it doesn't make that much power. You're probably gonna get some hate for it, but for like a Shelby like this, it, it's super quick. I feel like you can get away with it. And then last but not least, as far as cosmetic wise, I'm probably gonna get some slicks and new wheels for this. I haven't decided what kind of wheels I want to get or what color. I might just stick with black because of the black and yellow theme. But I do want to get wider tire or wider wheels. I think it comes stock at 11 and a half inches. So I'm probably going to do 12s because it's not... It's actually, it looks pretty flush. I think it's just the front side that's uh, a little 
not tucked. So this side, it's almost flush. So yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna end up doing. If you're an owner and has issues with rocks scraping down the side of here, luckily when I bought the car, the last owner already had this like plastic bit, so there's no rocks being flung onto the side of the car. So. Alright, so I'm basically gonna wrap up the video. Those are gonna be all my mods. So like I said, I'm gonna be doing the brake calibers, painting them yellow. I'm gonna do the decal on the side. I'm gonna do wheels, long two headers, <coughs> cold air intake. I might cam it if the engine holds up for longer than a year. If it doesn't, I might end up boosting it later. But that's gonna cost some serious money. So like the video. Comment and subscribe at the bottom. That's going to be it for that. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.